My love and affection for football goes a long time way back, since my school days. I couldn't play professional football, but like I mentioned earlier, my love and passion for football has been there. So right after my college, I started coming back to my passion. I was a government employee also, a government officer, but still, the subject was always there in my heart. So I used to coach, not as a coach, but I used to uh, participate in different kinds of football tournaments all over the state as football team manager. Mm -hmm. With that slowly I grew up, mm -hmm. the relationship I built through football. It's all because of football that I could build up this healthy relationship. It's all mm -hmm. because of football. Slowly, slowly from club level mm -hmm. I got elected as the president of the Tucson District Football Association. Mm -hmm. to be, for which I'm thankful to God and to the people of Tucson. I served as a president for two terms. And from there, I got nominated to represent the Nagaland Football Association as a general secretary as of now until now I'm here. So that is how my journey began. Like the saying goes, football, it didn't teach me any manners, but maybe it revealed my character to the youngsters, not only of our state, but of my constituency also. Maybe that was the reason today I got elected with the blessing of football fraternity and to the relationship and coordination I could build through. Yes. How long I'm related to you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It is what passion takes us yeah, all yeah. throughout the year. You told and, me. Right. As a uh, see, in order for football to develop, not only in our state, but when we look at our nation, mm -hmm. India as a whole, we need to focus mainly on the grassroots. Mm -hmm. Grassroots is very important. So we are trying hard, okay? We as NFA, we are trying hard. We, we have the baby league, which goes by the uh, name of Clue Curves, mm -hmm. an initiative of the All India Football Federation that we have set up in some few districts which we plan to take ahead to other rest districts of our state. Mm -hmm. So in within a few years time we are hoping that we could take the <coughs> Blue Curves Football Revolution to all the districts of our state. Yes, all districts we are lacking behind in our infrastructure but we have firm belief that with this government and the uh, leadership of our Honorable Chief Minister Chirini Firu, who of course is a very sports lover and very much in the youth, I hope that within a few uh, years of time we will have enough infrastructure to develop football at district and grassroots level. That's one thing. And in order to bring out more professionalism in our state, we are focusing on the youngsters as Nagaland Football Association. So, very short while, we will be coming up with an under-17 league of our own in our state, which will boost and which will open avenues for youngsters to pursue their professionalism in the game of football. And on the, in order to take football to a higher level, with the support of the government, which always the government was doing and willing to do, which will be discussed at the later session of the meeting, mm -hmm. we are trying to come up with a state football league. So it will provide a lot of opportunities to educate and unemployed youth also, and mm -hmm. it will raise the level of professionalism of our footballers out here. Mm -hmm. So those are the things um, we have in our pipeline to mm -hmm. take our football, our state football, to a higher level. We are a very football crazy state. We have seen that from the immense support we have received, whether it be local tournament or inter district tournaments, the support that we have received from the planners is very immense. It is very encouraging and it's very lovely to see that we have the support of the people when it comes to No wonder we call it the beautiful game. So, our state, we have a lot of venues and uh, uh, career options for football also. So, we in Nagas, it's high time we start taking football seriously not only as a hobby, but as a, as a passion and as a professional level. Because nowadays we all know uh, sports has become a global industry. So it's high time we Naga venture out and make use of the avenues on the platforms that has been provided to us. Mm -hmm. Football is very amazing in our state. The Nagaland Football Association conveyed its hardest congratulations to you for having been elected to the 14th Nagaland Legislative Assembly to be the teacher. Your dedication vision and a series of determined state taken as a social worker as well as a public servant and turned this place on a place you on a befitting pedestal. The Nagaland Football Association wishes you the best as though this new mantle of responsibility in honor of our honorable MLA Sri Bini the General Secretary NFA. 
Special welcome to our Honorable and Elaine, who has created a history in the annual of the NFV while holding the office of NFV for being elected to the <coughs> Nagara Legislative Assembly as a member. Your victory is NFV victory and football member of the state. NFV will be elected as member to the Nagara Legislative Assembly. It is indeed a proud moment for all of us to, to have him as member in the highest office of the state. Many, many congratulations to you, sir, from all football fraternity of the state. I, as HOR of the state, and along with the Nagaland referee, Nagaland referee extend our heartiest congratulations to you and your constituent assembly sector for having elected you as their representatives as well as leading our people to a prosperous future of our state. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, Football days that when I was, I'm still the secretary of Parami, Chamber Secretary of this world, I've been Kemal Chon Bamiya support taking up, Mr. Kaskanda support taking up, I can get Kamura on the shape. Achibi, I mean, government represent on a jam, the hotel, I've been on a support taking me. I mean, Bona said, I've been on a support taking up, or I've been a basic member. When football, government level, I mean, step higher with our coaches, or go. I wrote to him, Rivina, to strike him one. Programs pipeline, we say, we We join effort with collective minds and with thoughts. We can all come on and Thank you so much. Association in the being the highest echelon of Nagaland football fraternity, has indeed played a remarkable role in nurturing young aspiring talents and has paved a roadmap for the younger generation to follow. And for such visionary individuals, we all heartedly thank you. I also really like that Shin Bini, General Secretary of NFA, has been elected as an honorable MLA of the 14th Nagaland Legislative Assembly. And for which we all are very really proud of. I believe Shri Bengi involvement in Nagaland Legislative Assembly will be more welcome and opportunities for NFA. Nagaland TV, Sop Manulaga Awas. Watch us live on Geo TV and on your television sets as well. For Dumapu viewers, we are on channel number 994 in Global Chapter. And Kohima and Mokokchong viewers, switch to channel number 138 on Hornbill Digital. For all news and updates, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter.